Y'all was about to be mad at me for 2.3 seconds because I almost did not pick up my camera at all. It's like fucking 90 degrees. I'm about to go buy a bottle of liquor in the lobby because y'all, I just had a Casamigo shot and that fucking one Casamigo shot was $19. Who doing it? Another thing, a bitch ain't wearing no makeup because it's 90 degrees. And one thing Brie don't do is heat and makeup. One thing I ain't gonna do is sweat and have beads of makeup on my damn face. You know, that's why you gotta kinda keep that skin together and I've been slipping a little bit, but you gotta keep that skin together for, for shit like this. Cause sometimes you can't go outside in this heat with this makeup on, girl. Your whole face will be on the floor. Who on that? Who on that? Y'all, I almost did not record anything. Like I was this close to like, not picking up the camera, but we both, it's only the second day. It's only the second day. It's only the second day. So There's a whole pool over here and a pool, a bar. We was over here last night, but they're here playing games, pool, bar. From our room. And then the bar. Ooh, they have a media center. Ooh. You can play some chess. No, yeah, chess. Y'all, I have to learn chess. They have checkers. They have game consoles, PlayStation 4, PlayStation Xbox 5. Wait, no, Xbox Series. Girl, I don't know. PlayStation 4. And they got a motherfucking pool table. Me and Amber needs to come down here tomorrow, tonight. They got a pool table, I wanna shoot some pool. All right, we got the goods. We got the goods, we got some tzatziki. Some tzatziki, a Red Bull, and some chips.
child was soothed bitch okay my inner child was super soothed okay i had so much fun i was just on the rise everything was just so perfect and smooth we did have to go get some liquor though i was like you know what mm -mm. we love to be here for hours and you know disney world is a dry a dry park i said oh no man so we just we went to go get some liquor. I had put it in like a little sippy cup. We're on vacation. Like I want a cocktail, a beer, or something. Like enjoy myself. Like we ain't got no kids with us. We grown. Like we kicking it, you know. But anyway, oh my god. When I say I had so much fun, we took the most random pictures. By the end of the night, I was like fucking drunk. Like, but a good fun drunk though, you know? Oh, because I do not like being drunk. That's one thing about it. Like, I don't drink to get drunk. A nice little cute buzz. A, light, a nice little cute tipsy is cute. But I don't like that. Like, I can't remember. Uh-uh. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Okay. Y'all know what time it is. So. What's that giving? So, I love me a good kettle chip. And I seen these New York spicy dill pickle kettle chips. And I was about to open them and eat some. But I was like, you know what? Let me grab my camera. Oh my God, we just had some crab balls too. Oh, oh yeah, you missed it, girl. You missed it, girl. You missed it. Okay. Y'all know every time I travel, I have to get some crab balls. Like I'm a crab ball connoisseur. And y'all know if we go out of town, period, we're gonna eat good. I mean, why are we here? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ain't like that. Outside of eating good, y'all know a bitch love a good crab ball. So anytime I go anywhere, we're always hitting up a crab spot. It's giving pickle. Definitely get a little bit of pickle. Giving dill pickle. I ain't even gonna hold you. It's giving dill pickle, but it's also like ain't nothing to write home to mama about. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, this bathing suit, this bathing suit gonna give me what I need every time. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Okay. I'm not a one and done type of girl, baby. You gonna you gonna see this. I keep stuff for a long time, baby. We not we not retiring her yet. We not retiring her yet. We ain't retiring. We ain't retiring her yet. Okay. Okay. I don't know about y'all, but baby, I'm gonna get some wear and tear out of some shit. All right, all right. But new baby, this one's coming soon. So today is one of my last days here. I'm sorry, I did not catch much footage, okay? I tried to just get little highlights, so it might be a lot of montage in this video. But I mean, that's the point of a vacation. You know, you want to be present, you know what I'm saying? Like, the, the camera is not the first thing I be trying to pick up. I almost have to remember it. But that just means you're having fun. You're living good. You're in the moment, as I should be. You know what I'm saying? I'm capturing with these lens right here. You feel me? Today, we just want to be poolside. Like, I just want to relax. 
have cocktails and just be poolside. I don't want to be running around. I want some sushi. Like I want to order. I think we're going to order some. Um, we just want to relax. We want to order some sushi, have some drinks, sit poolside, enjoy ourselves, get us a nice little Florida tan before we leave. Because when we go back home, y'all, it's supposed to be snowing. So I'm going to take in this hot ass weather. As you guys see, I'm pouring me up. This week was a tequila. This vacation was giving very much tequila, y'all. And the tequila been treating me right out here. Like, I've been waking up feeling amazing, fine. When we went to Disney World, I feel like I drunk damn near a whole bottle of this by myself, y'all. And that's just crazy. Because so I was walking around a lot and, like, kind of, like, walking it off that I didn't feel it the next day. But, anyway, y'all know how we do. Um, when you on vacation, you live your life like it's golden, boo. Okay? And that I shall. So, y'all see, I'm woke. I just put on my little bathing suit so that we can sit poolside, eat us some sushi, have us some drinks, and just relax. Oh, I wish I had a book right now, but I don't. I didn't bring a book, you guys. I'm a little sad about it because who doesn't want to have a book when they are fucking poolside? relaxing sunbathing <sighs> who don't it's always good to get away from your daily routine and your, your daily scenery but you know what's even better is the fact that a vacation is not really an escape for me like i enjoy my home i enjoy my daily routines but it's also healthy to get out of that and oh my god we needed the sun we needed some heat we needed like newness we needed like you know we needed a a change in the daily pace you know what i'm saying so that's amazing but now we've been here what four or five days already and now i'm at that point now where i can still do a day or two but i am at that point where i'm like okay i have my fun i have my fun and i'm ready to kind of go back home and get back into that daily routine but it's always good to get away you know what i mean and while you are away have a fucking good time so we're gonna take a shot if you have something close, baby, get it. We're going to take a shot to just a good trip and just making it back home safely. Um, and just gratitude, you know, just taking time to just, you know, to appreciate your blessings. You know, I'm so, so blessed and I'm so, so grateful with all that I have. And I think sometimes we think about all the other shit and don't realize like how bomb and how good you got it. You know what I'm saying? Like I get to wake up every day and, and work for myself. I get to wake up every day and not have to listen to no fucking body. No boss, no manager, nobody giving me rules, telling me what to do. I get to wake up every day and run my business the way I want to, create the energy I want to create. I'm healthy, I'm loved, I have my person. Um, I enjoy just life. I enjoy the simple things. I romance. Like, I don't know. I just can't spell it. I don't wanna I don't wanna bore y'all with that. But y'all, I'm just in a good, a good space. A good, amazing space. And I'm just super, super grateful. So we're just gonna cheers to that. And then we're gonna go downstairs, get some sushi, and relax poolside. Pull up on 
me, baby, put it on me, put it on me.